okay realistically you know my stains but would y'all shower before y'all work out or after you work out because i know some people shower first thing at a.m get them ready for their workout and some people don't shower until after they go to the gym so in the comments let me know what would y'all do but this is the earliest i woke up in a minute around seven and that might not be early to those people that wake up at five but a lot of people when they say waking up in the morning they wake up around 10. I've been slacking. I've been waking up around 12 and stuff like that. It's not cute. It's not cute. But one thing I can say about waking up early is just a matter of doing it. What usually wakes me up, something like today, having a task plan, and that's the gym for the day with somebody else. Other times, not gonna lie, sometimes I wash my clothes at night and then I be like, oh, first thing in the morning? I gotta put my clothes in the dryer or check on my clothes or something like that. And he wakes me up, like not gonna lie. But um finna do my morning routine because I gotta hear it go. <laughs> It's not a perfected one, but I will give y'all a perfected one. And that'll show y'all my shower routine and all of that good stuff. So, be sure to watch that. And stay tuned. Because I keep waking up this story, y'all can have the perfect one. You feel me? I couldn't get a good angle of my pull-ups and dips when I tell you my leg hurts and I'm trying to act like it don't hurt because then my mom gonna be tweaking but because uh, because before I even went to the gym she's on some don't be doing too much with your leg you know that it hurt and I'm just like I done too much with my leg I started off with the 15 and I knew it was hurting bro I knew it was hurting the extensions was hurting at 15 pounds bro but I went to 60 something and then I still done leg press for y'all. Like, why do I do this for y'all? Like, do y'all even love me? Be real. Y'all love me? Cause like, I'm doing this for y'all. So if y'all care about what I'm doing for y'all, drop hearts in the comments, real talk. Cause my leg hurt and I'm just trying to go home and get some pills. But my brother-in-law left his freaking jacket. I'm outside with the one and only. Um, oh yeah, yeah, I'm tripping. I'm like, what am I finna say to y'all? Um, I couldn't get the best shots of my workout. Bro, what are you doing? I couldn't get the best shots of my workout. But in the description, linked below, will be a YouTube video that I did that I explained my workout pretty much like 108642 drop set and super set but with calisthenics so not really drop set i don't know what it's called like a ladder a ladder and a super set so i got that for y'all i'm gonna have a link below so y'all can go watch that until i can get y'all a better workout video but y'all see that i woke up at seven done what i needed to do and look at him he's so cute and went to work out 
So now y'all know y'all finna have that perfected AM and PM routine. Go to say what to the camera. Alright, not gonna lie to y'all. After I hit the gym, I had like this much time before I had to go to get my nails done. I had another appointment. This is my second time getting my nails done. So <laughs> at that. So not too much. Um I'm gonna show y'all a better view. Just like that. Not too shabby, isn't it? Um, I wish I had her Instagram because she does my like whole family nails practically. And she A1 sauce. I just don't like adding nails. This is my second time in my whole life getting my nails done. You feel me? And I don't I honestly think if it wasn't for them going to her, I would have got my nails done so soon. Like I wouldn't have, you know? It would have took me a little more time. Ignore the kid in the background, okay? So I'll just leave it out. Ignore the kid in the background. But yeah, I barely had time to you know, do what I need to do. I came home, I took like a 10 minute thought nap. You know those naps where you just, they're not naps, but you just lay down for a little bit because you need to rejuvenate. I'm gonna tell y'all, it was hard waking up at 7. But what? What's the scripture today? Realistically, the problem is the fact that I used to wake up early all the time. I used to get woke up at 5 a.m., say uh, goodbye to my dad before he got to work and just work out and live my best life. But I've been slacking in between getting sick and just slacking out, which is easy to do, even if you're like the most consistent person, it's still easy. To have days where you slack, that's why people have weekly resets and all of that. It's easy, bro. It's easy. So if you're slacking, you're not alone. But I was like, no, nah, I have stuff to get done. So I made the decision to wake up at seven. I'm not waking up past past seven no more, like past eight. Probably not. Maybe ten? Nah, but like waking up at twelve wasn't for me. It makes me feel miserable throughout the day. I don't get nothing accomplished. If I do, it's like the middle of the night and I like to get stuff done in the morning. So I got the rest of my day. But speaking of getting stuff done, my last video was at 53 views. That's the most I got on either of my channels. The other channel I deleted, well, like I deleted the videos off of it, moves on to this channel and um, I'm getting this channel up. That's the most views I've gotten so far, 53. No, it's not like big, but when I'm at like 1,000 views or subscribers or 10,000, a million, I'm gonna look back at this and see how hype I was about 53, because y'all don't understand. 53, and I gained a subscriber. Y'all like me? Y'all must like me. No, really, but I'm happy. I'm very happy about it and I'm very thankful for y'all. So know that I'm doing the best I can do with this content. Like, one day in the future, y'all are going to see the predicament I was in and how I was making these videos for y'all. Right now, I'm not going to do that. But just know that, like, I'm doing the best that I can to make these videos with the little that I have, the no stories that I have, record the recording process that I have. So, literally, all my goal was to make more than the 21 views that I had. Before I left my channel, I was at a consistent, like, 14 to 17. Since I've been back, I haven't made lower than 21 views. So I was like, okay, let's touch 30. We touched 53, bro. That's a big deal for me. That's a big deal. So when I um blow up, it's really going to be about the 53 people that put a smile on my face. Or 53 views that put a smile on my face. The comments I'm receiving that put a smile on my face. And I like to see me smile, right? I like dimples. Who don't, don't like looking at dimples? Be realistic. That being said, I'm going to show you all how to make multiple recipes with four simple ingredients that you should have in your house right now. At least 99 98, probably 97 if you're struggling, should have these ingredients in your house. Four. It's just four ingredients and you're making multiple things. What? You can make multiple things with these four ingredients, okay? Now, let me tell you this, though. I'm not talking about edible. You feel me? It is consumable, yes. These are consumable ingredients, but I'm talking about for the bod. You feel me? Because there's a lot of hair products, a lot of hair oils, uh, body scrubs and all that that we spend money on. And when you really, really think about it, why are we spending money on what we can save money on in our house? It's all a matter of getting up and making it. And this will be a quick process. These are, these are quick recipes that y'all can make. That's what I'm going to show y'all. Because it's two reasons. One, why be unhealthy? Why why spend money on products being unhealthy? And two, catering to yourself is like the best thing you can do. Not gonna lie. I said this in a previous video. I don't know if it was on this channel or my old channel. I'll check. But, realistically, taking care of yourself naturally makes you happy. Like catering to yourself, you may be sad. But once you get up and cater to yourself and be consistent with it, everything just changes. I know this personally, okay? I know this personally because... I've been sad, I've been happy, I've been up and down. <sighs> the dogs are tripping on me, hold on. It's hot, y'all. So if I get out of breath, <sighs> not too much. Don't be clowning me in the comments, okay? Don't be clowning me in the comments. But my space got invaded, so I'm gonna give y'all a little rundown in here. And then the next clip will be me making 
the recipes and showing you. All right, so as stated, I've been through the whole sad and I wanted to take care of myself thing. And we let that get to our heads way too much. Like we, as in literally almost everybody in this world right now. You feel me? Like that don't look right. But anyways, like we accept depression, we accept laziness, we choose to be miserable and sit down and do nothing. When it's stated, like same with the morning thing, it's just a matter of getting up and doing it. You know what I mean? You can, you don't know my family, but like let's say you didn't know my family. If you ask my family, they'll tell you. I would, I would be in the bathroom all day catering to myself. Whether I had, like I would go to work, school, the basic people things, right? Not like... Y'all know what I mean? Not like basic people things, but like normal things. Like I had a life. Everybody has a life. But I would make the time. If if it's right after school where I work out, I wake up early to work out. Right after school, I eat and then cater to myself. You know what I mean? So just putting that time throughout the day, I would be in there all day, every day, doing my hair, doing a lip scrub, doing a face scrub, doing a body scrub, making my own products which is way more healthy. It got me way more far than um, buying products that when you really look at it, all this stuff is not healthy. They're lying. Like they lie about so much. It's not healthy. So making it, my arm hurt. <laughs> oh no. Yeah. Oh my gosh. My arm hurts because I worked out today. This is the thing about having a phone, filming on your phone. But realistically, if you just get up and take the steps to do it, you just naturally get happier. And that's the point I'm trying to get across. Like, I just got up and done stuff, and I just started getting happier. You, um, you got to make the choice to get out of a certain place in your life. Don't just sit there. Don't just sit in your house. Don't just do nothing. Um, and everybody's like they don't have time when a lot of people do have free time on their hands They just spend it being miserable and that's just the truth. It's no way to sugarcoat it The only thing we're finna be sugarcoating though is these lip scrubs. So let's get into that because it's stated healthier and we'll get you way further Okay We're on lip scrubs and body scrubs. I'm going to be showing y'all these very fundamental because y'all are spending money on these scrubs from Walmart and Bath and Body Works when you can make it at your uh, house for cheaper and it'd be way healthier and that's the goal like be healthy be sufficient be sustainable get prioritize yourself okay that's that's that should be our goal for the year so all my subscribers prioritize yourself and watch my content let's go all right I took back my territory we can get this process done now, let me say this. I be looking at myself every time I make these videos, and sometimes I try to look at y'all, but I be looking at myself. I can't help that. Y'all gonna have to deal with it. Just look at me and just enjoy me. Look at myself. Does that, does that sound like a Leo thing? <laughs> you got me. <laughs> now, most of y'all see that I have, like, perfect lips. I'm perfection. Only flaw is the fact that I need braces. You feel me? And I feel like God didn't give me braces. I eat straight teeth because he knew I would be too much for y'all to handle. But I'm going to get braces one day. And y'all go see. Y'all go see. Okay. But let me tell y'all. My lips have only been chapped like once my whole life. I'm 20. I'm 20, y'all. I'm gonna be 21 this year. My chips have only been, my lips have only been chapped once in my life. So when I say I used to take care of myself, what the fuck? I used to take care of myself. And that's what I'm trying to do better of this year. And that's really the purpose of this whole video. And I want y'all to do the same. So it's stated for the hundredth time. Let's get into this recipe. And y'all see that I lick my lips a lot. So, be mindful of that. I lick my lips 24-7, and that usually dries your lips out, but I'm going to put y'all on. So, 
These four are the base ingredients. Turmeric, sugar, agave, or honey for most of y'all cases, and coconut oil. My nose look good down here. Give y'all a view. Because the other view was kind of shabby. Now, kind of lie to y'all though. We will be bringing in ingredients like essential oils and lime. But some of these are interchangeable, so technically most scrubs do have four ingredients. Body scrub, okay. Just these three. Sugar, coconut, and agave can be for a body scrub. But really, you can dump that out. This isn't mandatory at all, especially for body. These two, perfect for body. Add your oil for scent. This is lavender. Some of y'all might want orange because it's citru citrus. And a lot of y'all like citrus flavors, but I can't personally do orange. And lavender is my favorite scent. But if you have hyperpigmentation, that's where the turmeric will come in. All right? And you can put the turmeric on your face, on your body. Wherever you have your hyperpigmentation, it doesn't matter. And um, if you really want to go in with, like, dark spots, like in the inner thighs, the armpits and all that, pair the lime with the turmeric. But if you're going to do that, do it, like, two times a week, okay? But we're not going to be doing that right now. I just wanted to tell y'all, because you can replace this. Stuff like this, you say shea, sugar, all of that, it's not that healthy, y'all. It's not. You can get your own shea butter, you can use coconut oil, it don't matter. But today, we're going to be making the lip scrub. Come on, man. All right, I know that may be um, disappointing for some of y'all. I don't put this on there. Okay, I know that may be disappointing for some of y'all, but I promise y'all, if y'all just comment down below and tell me y'all want the full recipes, I'll give y'all a body scrub, face scrub, a lip scrub, instead of just telling you about it, I actually make it on film for y'all. Because realistically, I'll post whatever y'all want, health-wise, internal health, external health, you feel me, physical health. I'll post whatever is really a fact the matter of if I, like, feel the need to post about it, like what I've recently been doing, like, with my nails, which will be, will be linked in the comments down below. But, um... Other stuff is like, yeah, if y'all ask for it, like if I post um, food that look good, ask for the recipe, you know? I didn't post any food today, because when I tell y'all, one, I really ate today. I ate some rolls, <laughs> uh, but I haven't actually ate, like, nothing healthy, so I'm not going to waste my time showing y'all. Well, like, of course, one day I'll give y'all a realistic day in life, but today was horrible. <laughs> today was horrible when it came to eating, so we're not going to do too much of that. With that being said, though, I need to get a shirt that says not too much on me, and a shirt that says with that being said, all my fans buy my merch. And since I started this video, I gained more views. We're at 55, and, um, well, since I started this little clip. Or like whenever I said I had 53 views. No, we're at 55 and we gained two subscribers. So I want to thank y'all. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video. Let me help make this scrub because y'all gonna be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. I'm sorry. Okay, now while I'm doing this, I am going to tell y'all some things that I do to keep up with my lips. Because as stated, I, um, I have good lips, y'all. No weird stuff. Alright, so what I do, instead of doing like chapstick, because some stuff like Carmex is very bad. Y'all just, do y'all see this? Y'all don't even see it, so I don't even matter. But uh, stuff like Carmex and stuff like that is very bad. I'm using two different spoons, by the way, guys. And Carmex dries out people's lips. And people, most, a lot of people don't know that the reason why their lips don't look that good or their lips dry out is because Carmex. If I weigh something, oh, well, don't say nothing, okay? But people don't know that it's actually the Carmex that's drying out the lips. So what I used to do, my bad, I'm hitting y'all. I'm so sorry, don't beat me up. I use this coconut oil on my lips every day. And if I have tea tree oil, I use tea tree on my lips. It's the best thing y'all can do because it keeps your lips moisturized. It keeps them from chapping. And you have long term moisture instead of just temporary moisture. You know what I mean? So, you can do a lip scrub one to two times a week and daily. You can do tea tree or coconut oil or shea butter. But uh, tea tree has a strong smell that I personally really like. But if you don't like the smell of tea tree, then you can most definitely just use coconut oil. Just a side though, let me know if I should release a lip scrub and like a healthy chapstick on my uh, site. Because I will. And I'll give y'all a discount if y'all watch the video. Not gonna lie. So, um, yeah, it's pretty much just this. You can do the scrub. Two times a week, and you can. Not a lot. I look, you just want to film all this scrubs for y'all right now. So please, please, please let me know if y'all want it. I'll make a video specifically for that. But um, you can do lip scrub two times a week, and then daily you can do the coconut oil and all of that stuff. And uh, brush your lips. Toothbrush? I'm over here asking about the toothbrush. Alright, this is your lip, and this is the toothbrush. Just brush your lips, like you would brush your teeth, and it gets rid of the like chappiness. So this can get rid of the chaps and prevent the chaps. Another look at the nubbies. Yeah, let's, let's, let's go utilize this. I'm gonna show you an example of the brushing. You can have two separate brushes, but this is just a little, a little example for y'all. I be talking lower in my bathroom. That's why I sound like different, cause I'm trying to force myself to be lower. But yeah, um, you literally just but you would do it for like a certain amount of time, just however you feel. It's really based off feel. I don't really calculate. And you can add toothpaste because the mint in the toothpaste does help with your lips and it helps get rid of the chaps that you already have. And that's what we're getting into right now. I did add a few drops of peppermint oil. I would usually add tea tree, but it stated I don't have tea tree. Scrub is basic. You can, you know, pair it with a, um, 
Body scrub, face scrub. Clean your hands. I want to show y'all a little scoopy scoop. It's too much of something in here, not gonna lie. But you get it? Just literally scrub it. Too much oil. We'll be okay. That's what it is, that feminine oil. Leave it on for at least 30 seconds. You can do two minutes. Up to two minutes. So now that it's been sitting, saturated, and coated, you can really like scrub. This is what I would scrub. You're funny. Um, and then you rinse your face. Same with my hair, same with my face. After I rinse off my wash, that's when I would go in with my oil as a moisturizer. So I'll just oil my lips. Try it up a little bit if I wanted to. Or leave it how it is. And I'll go about my day. Super. I know I'm just hopping locations on y'all, but my locations keep getting invaded. But I'm getting tired. I hope y'all enjoyed today's video. I'm finna do the rest of my night routine and head to sleep. I'm trying to practice looking at y'all. But I keep seeing myself. But okay, um, yeah. I'ma do my night routine, which we linked below with my AM routine, AM PM routine. The perfected one will be made soon. Cause I feel like I'm getting my life together. So I think I can record it for y'all. I think I can record it for y'all a little quicker. If y'all want the scrub, let me know. If y'all want the perfect AM and PM routine, let me know. Any other videos y'all may want, drop it down below in the comments. And don't forget, purple hearts, purple and black hearts. With that being said, my loves, 